As you can see here, the tank room is now com fully complete. You've got the hardening off stand just at the front there, which will have shake off on the front of it. The two air cons have been installed. One for the germination room, and one for the processing room. It's the entrance to the processing room. And this is the access to the tank room just here. And as you can see at the back there, we've already planted out six benches. They have rocket, fancy lettuce. The next crop to go into will be sweet basil and red basil. Here we have the germination room. There's 230 seedlings on each shelf. Here we have sage. Next to that, sweet basil. These are all dated so we know how long they actually take to propagate. This can vary in various conditions. Mescaline mix. It's a mixture of herbs as well as lettuce. There's frilly lettuce mix. And again, This room has a high output fluorose. 36 watts on each one. These will be doubled up later on down the track. The room in total was about six meters by four meters. Just a simple increment timer. As you can see, the floor is painted with gray paving paint and is spotless, which this room needs to be at all. Here we are in the tank room. There's two 5,000 litre tanks in the ground. I've switched the pump off for the moment just while I take this vision. The second tank over the back there is a... We put that in for the future expansion to strawberries. The rear of the room there, you see all the pots and cubes, propagation material, nutrients. That's 12 months supply for this 24 bench system. Venturi and the pickup pipe. Here are the dosing drums, both A and B nutrient. There's a concentrated form. That's the pH drum currently dosing it to go down. Three quarter horsepower stay right. Here's the peristolic pump dosing both A and B drums as well as the pH which is on which is pump three on the right hand side there. Here's the main controller Dosetronic from Blue Lab. Here's the sample pot which takes samples of the nutrient and the pH probe and conductivity probe will monitor that and adjust it accordingly. The sample pot also has a temperature probe in it as well. I'm not sure if you can be able to make it out but there are, there are the values. We're shooting for an 8 CF and a 6.3 pH. The Dostronic is in function mode with the thermo thermometer to the left of the unit there. Venturi working here. It's almost like a spa pool. See water starting to return back to the tank after going through the benches outside. 